Cherry Blossom family and welcome back to my channel if you're new here. Hi guys, my name is Jessie, also known as Miss Cherry. And today I have a really fun unboxing from my friends over at Tokyo Kawaii Club. Now, I have to admit, I have had this mailer since I think December. <laughs> I think I've had this mailer since December. So it was supposed to be part of my Vlogmas series and then it got shoved behind a box that was on my shelf of where I was storing things and I didn't realize it was there. I feel so silly. So anywho, I had gotten Tokyo Kawaii Club for three months. I like to get their mailers every now and again just because I love everything from Tokyo and I have been missing Tokyo and the parks so bad as many of you can probably understand right now. And so we are going to go ahead and open this. Now I will include Tokyo Kawaii Club's information down below in the description box and also how much the box or the mailer is here because I don't remember off the top of my head. And also I will say today is another installment of self vlogging teen. So I hope you guys are hanging in there. I am thinking of all of you. And I know that this has been a really trying time, but I hope that this video can bring a smile to your face and I really truly hope that you are all safe and healthy and I want to thank you for spending time with me uh, during this crazy time in the universe. You guys mean the world to me. So anyway, let's go ahead and see what's in this puppy. So I kind of opened the top just so it was a little bit easier for me to grab. It always comes with some sort of bag from the Tokyo parks. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. So we have these new mo's and when we were in Tokyo last year, we bought some of these guys, but this is their first anniversary. I happened to get the Dale one and he's wearing like a really funny outfit. I don't know where, oh, he's over there. He's got like a little stocking cap and a rain, a rain hat on. Ooh, oh my gosh, there's a lot in here. Okay, so I'm gonna start with this. Uh, there's another small bag in here and I feel something very soft and squishy. So let's see. Oh. <gasps> oh my goodness. <gasps> Holy moly. We have got, this is adorable. This is a little scrump ice cream cone. And it's got her little hair tuft, her little bow, and her like, oh, her teal um, skin. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. And this looks like it's a bag charm, or maybe it could be um, used as a piece of jewelry, possibly. I'm pretty sure it's a bag charm. A lot of things that come from, uh, a lot of uh, Tokyo products are bag charms, and it does have a little button that like represents her eye. <gasps> I've never seen anything like this. This is adorable. Oh my gosh, well. That was quite uh, the thing to start with, guys. I'm super impressed. And then there's something in a soft packet. <gasps> oh, I think I see a Lotso ear. <gasps> oh my gosh. Um, excuse? Holy moly. You guys. So this is a plastic cup and it has Lotso all over it. Take me back to Japan, please. Please. Okay, I love that. I love that so much. Okay, and then next we have um, something small. There's an, I'm sorry, there was another bag. This is a Tokyo Disney Resort bag. And there's something in a package here. <gasps> oh, what is this? This is adorable. So it is Lotso and oh my gosh, it's a stapler. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What, what, 
<gasps> oh, it's the babiest, most tiniest baby stapler I've ever seen. Oh, I can't. I can't. I don't even know how to use it. I'm gonna have to Google. Oh my goodness. Is this the cutest thing you've ever seen? Since I'm working from home, since most all of us are working from home, I'm gonna set up a tiny, tiny, little bitty workstation. And I'm gonna put it online. I wanna show you guys. But this is going in there and I, I love miniature things. I don't know why. If you are one of these people, I feel like there's a very specific type of individual out in the world that loves miniature things and I am one of those people. You'll have to let me know if you are also one of those people, but this favorite item, no question. I don't think there's anything that can top that item. I say that now. <laughs> uh, and then Michael, in he's the curator of these mailers. In every single mailer, he always says some sort of handwritten note. And this is on a little piece of notebook paper, or a little piece of paper that has Winnie the Pooh and Piglet. Adorable. I love that. I like personal notes. Ooh, we have a button, I can tell. <gasps> no. <gasps> I've never seen anything like this. <gasps> okay. I also love comic strip style art. So they're just, I mean, Michael's killing it this, this month or two months ago or three months ago. Oh my gosh, I'm horrible. Anyway, this, it's the scene where she is singing to Ursula and it's drawn out in a comic book form. Super cool. I will definitely be adding this to my Little Mermaid pin board. And I dropped everything on the ground. Okay, we're back. Next, I feel a notebook. Oh, the heart. Oh, oh, I love this. Oh my gosh. We have a notebook from Tokyo Disney. This is so cute. Okay, I'm freaking out. So here's the notebook. It does have Mickey and Minnie riding the Dumbo ride, but check this out. It has Minnie and Mickey riding all of the Disney park attractions from Tokyo and their ride vehicles. Like it's got 20,000 leagues under the sea. It's got the little gondola ride. It's got Big Thundy. It's got the teacups, Tower of Terror. Oh my gosh, this is so neat. And it's graph paper. I love this, especially because I've been to Tokyo. I have so much appreciation for this. Oh my gosh, Michael. I think I'm gonna have to get Tokyo Quiet Club again. <laughs> Every time I open a mailer from them, I'm like, I need to get them again. Michael, we need, <gasps> you guys. Oh my goodness, I can't. I am impressed. This is from the Tokyo Disney Store, and I know that because it says it on the package. We've gotta open this. I wanna show you all of these folders. Okay, so let's start with, oh my gosh. Let's start with this of Ariel. She looks beautiful beautiful in this image and then the back and then you can place your paper inside of here now this is not the traditional um u.s size it's a little bit thinner but it, like um the width is a little bit is the, the width of the folder is a little bit smaller than like u.s eight and a half by eleven it's not terrible though i do have other ones of these that i've gotten from Tokyo Disney before and I showed you that in the haul. If you haven't seen my Tokyo Disney hauls from when I went to Tokyo, I will link them up above so you can see them. But look at this sketch. This it does this scream art of animation. 
Oh my gosh. My favorite Disney resort in Walt Disney World is Art of Animation. And these sketches are kind of like all over that hotel. These are stunning. I just love that there's like nothing on there except her beautiful face. And they chose really beautiful images. Oh, this is so cool. So this is an aerial cleanup model. And it says the material is property of the Walt Disney Company. This looks like all of their concept art for Ariel, some of their final um, sketches of her. How beautiful. And it says, I have supplied some suggestions for mouth shapes when singing. Ariel sustains notes which will stretch the mouth shapes for several frames. These mouth shapes can also be applied to the rest of the picture. Oh, that's so neat. Oh, that's so cool. And then last, but certainly not least, we have another from that comic book collection. And it is the uh, similar to the button. The button had like this circle of an image on it. Now we have the whole thing. And then there is just a little Ariel and flounder on the back. Wow. Wow, that was the best Tokyo Kawaii Club mailer I have ever received. I feel like the value of that is significant in comparison to some of my other mailers. Thank you so much, Michael, for curating such an amazing mailer. He does ask for preferences and he does curate the mailers to your preferences. And also, I probably will be sending in an order for him for a FOMO promo. So his FOMO promos are really reasonably priced for uh, for a personal shopper in Tokyo. A new Lotso plush that has been released where he's wearing strawberry suspenders, then I'm gonna have to get that, but wow. That was such an awesome mailer. I mean, I, I know you guys, I love this stapler. <laughs> You'll have to let me know down below. I mean, these were incredible. The notebook, <gasps> I'm gonna have to set, I will set up a little, station, a little workstation at home to show you guys all of my amazing supplies that I got <laughs> just for fun. And I'll make a little drink. We'll have a little drink <laughs> out of all things Tokyo Kawaii Club. Oh, that's so funny. Let me know down below what your favorite item was from this, or if you get Tokyo Kawaii Club, what your favorite item is from this mailer. Anyway, guys, that's gonna do it for me. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Also, please be sure to subscribe down below for more self vlogging teen series that's coming out in the following weeks. I love you guys so much. I hope that you're being safe and I hope that you are healthy and happy in the world wherever you are and I will see you guys in the next video. TTFN, bye!